So hi everyone. Yes, my name's Rupert Ford, and I'll be I'll be chairing this session along with Carlos, um, Carlos Asuna. Um, just a very quick advert right at the very beginning. We'll be talking about um, domain-specific languages. Oh, thanks, Chris. Yes, you can see the domain-specific languages. Uh, we're going to be talking about um, domain-specific languages in this session uh, later on. And um, there's actually a week-long DSL workshop coming up, which is uh, sponsored by Easy Waste Two, probably late November. So if you're interested after this, then um, then there'll be a much longer um, overview and introduction to DSLs then. So look out for that. Okay. So this this is just a, a summary of, of what we're going to be talking about today. Um, as Julian said, we've got um, we've got a block of of three thirty minute presentations followed by a break. Then there'll be two thirty minute presentations. We've we've gone slightly AWOL on on this bit. What we we've done rather than have a thirty minute introduction, um, we're actually going to give you an up to an hour on the self-guided tutorial to go and try things yourself um, and, and we'll be around and have a breakout group for that we'll talk about that a bit later so we'll have um, we'll have three presentations a break uh, and then and then two presentations afterwards um, we will be asking uh, if there are any questions um, you can ask those at the end of each presentation not the end of the the, the 90 minutes what what um, if, if you do have questions as things go along um, then please feel free to those in the chat, um, and um, because uh, the, obviously the present the presenter won't be able to answer, but there are other people here other, um, who are involved who might be able to answer things as we go along. So um, feel free to do that, and we'll try and pick up any questions at the end of each one. Um, so um, the, the pres presenters I've, I've uh, written down here, um, all, all bar one, are from two institutions. Um, Myself and uh, Andrew Porter are from the Hartree Centre, uh, which is uh, in, in, in Daresbury Laboratory, which is halfway between Liverpool and Manchester. Um, and uh, we're in, we're in a, um, Daresbury Lab is part of STFC, Science and Technology Facilities Council. That's lots of acronyms, I apologise. If you don't know who they are, you can look those up if you're interested. Um, the other presenters, um, so that's Carlos, um, Giacomo and Ben, um, they are from Meteo Swiss. Um, and um, uh, which is the Swiss Meteorological Office, obviously, as you might expect. Um, they're um, experts um, in, in a DSL called Dawn, and, and Giacomo is going to be talking about that later. Myself and Andy um, have been developing a DSL called Cyclone, so, so that's why those two things are there, and Andy's going to be talking about that. Um, but the, the additional speaker is, uh, is Simon McIntosh-Smith, um, who we're very pleased to have here. He, he's a, a professor in high performance computing at Bristol University. Um, he has a lot of experience and knowledge in, in hardware. Um, um, could whoever's someone please please because I've got echo. echo. Anyone can try? Oh, that's better. Thank you very much. Um, so, so he's got a lot of expertise in, in many core and heterogeneous processes um, and um, in applications to try and run those, particularly towards exascale. And, um, and he's also got, so this is great for us, he's got a lot of knowledge, experience and interest in performance quality as well, and you'll see those words here. So with that, I'll pass you over to Simon. Thank you very much.